Hey, Nate, uh, just your thoughts on uh, the way your team played overall tonight in the game. You know, there was parts of the game that, uh, you know, we had good pushes. We had a good chance to um, get back to 3-2 to get back into that game. Um, and against a team like this, you, you know, especially against a line like that, that's going really well, you know, turnovers will kill you. And you give them, you give them stuff. If you give them plays, they're going to, you know, they're going to come down and, and, uh, and have an opportunity to put in the back of your net and, you know, and give good players time and space. They're going to make plays. And, you know, it's, it's been hard, like, you know, the last couple of games, you know, but we got to find a way to win, you know, we got to find a way to win these ones. And as you look ahead to seeing these guys again tomorrow night, particularly that line, is it the turnovers that are the biggest thing that you guys need to clean up to try and limit them or what else can you do? Well, I mean, yeah, so secret, you know, you, you, when you play against you know, some of the top guys in the world, the best thing you can do is make them play defense, make them play in their zone, make them, you know, make it a lot harder for them, you know, when it's easy game for them and when they can wheel and deal and move through the neutral zone, through the offensive zone, you know, all game long, it's, to, it's uh it's you're playing with fire you know with with guys like that so you, you have to make them defend more and that's really you know that's kind of the, that's the bottom line i guess to the top players you have to i mean otherwise they're going to have too much time and space and too much energy to come back at you next up is daniel wagner nate uh bef the shift before your goal it seemed to be a pretty good shift by the Grovac line and that you know, that's a, a line of guys that maybe haven't been in the lineup uh, prior to this. Uh, what did you see from that shift that allowed you guys to get in the offensive zone and, and get a goal back early in the first? Anytime you can get momentum from a group and anytime you can get something that's going to propel your your, uh, your other lines, um, no matter who it is, what, what deep air, what line is out there doing it, it is contagious. So that's the type of things that um that we talk about you know all the time you, know, you can that stuff feed you feed off each other and you feed off a, a shift like that where you guys are out there they're grinding you, you know that they're um putting in the hard work and grinding them down um so it allows your your next your next guys to go out and and have a chance at maybe a tired group and a, a, a tired deep pair that have been out there for a while and so it just you know it doesn't show up as much uh you know on the statue but that's something that makes a huge difference for the guys that are coming over the boards next and JT, the cameras caught you having a conversation with uh, Connor McDavid prior to the game. Uh, what was the topic of conversation heading into the game there? Uh, something private. Fair enough. Thank you. Yep. Next up is Ben Kuzma. Uh, a couple for JT. Uh, JT, uh, what did you see on your goal? Obviously, a, a great burst of speed there. And uh, going forehand, the backhand. And the second part of my question is, what did you make of the collective effort tonight, knowing that you lost a couple more forwards with Sutter Michaelis going down? You're down. You're up to eight forwards out of your your lineup uh, this season. Uh, a, your goal, and, and B, what did you make of the effort? Yeah, I just saw the puck kind of bounce to me. I knew it was going to be a little breakdown, and I uh, just tried to thought I had more speed than he than he did. And once I got around him, I just kind of made up my mind that I I didn't have a whole lot of time, so I just had to lift it no matter which way I went. Uh, and then, you know, the effort, I don't think effort's really our issue. I feel like we work hard every game. We've had the injury problem, you know, lately, a lot of new faces. Um, for me, that's it's no excuse. We want to win. Um, you know, we're, we're not playing bad. We're doing good things, but we're not, you know, we need to do more if we want to win against these teams that are, these guys are in the playoffs. They're trying to make a spot, you know, trying to win their division, whatever the, the case may be like they're they're playoff ready. These games are hard. I, you know, we, we take a lot of pride in, you know, playing well and competing in these games. And, uh, you know, we had our look, we have our, our chances, but um, just a couple mistakes obviously cost us today. Thank you.